TCU will have to travel. Let's see, Bob. Did they get the ball to the fort? No, they called timeout for the ball still in the backcourt. They've got the full 94 feet to go. Yes, they do. Yes, John they do. Brownlee is our player of the game. 17 points, 5 out of 5 from the line, including the two that has put Texas in front. We'll tell you more about it in just a moment as TCU will bring the ball in. Brownlee back. He has basket responsibility. The clock starts the moment somebody inbounds touches the ball. Dixon, two seconds, launches the shot. He hit it! Dixon hit it! Dixon has hit the shot at the buzzer, and TCU has won it. I do not believe it. I cannot believe it. On behalf of the presidents and chancellors of the Big 12 Conference, welcome. Thank you. Definitely a great day to be a TCU Horn Frog, I can tell you that. I am absolutely fired up. Dixon is returning to where he played his college ball to be the new head coach at TCU. At Pitt, Dixon's teams averaged, averaged 25 wins a year. You, you just want your institution to be proud of what you're doing and what your program represents, and, and we're going to do that. championship gets underway it's the 8 seed TCU taking on the 9 seed Oklahoma Williams stepping in the lane and able to take it to the other end for the throwdown that's all sitting right there for Jamie Dixon's team as they pick up this win 82 63 the final score the number one team in America the Jayhawks taking on TCU Act three is there for Brandon Parrish. He scores five straight. He'll be kicking and roll. Here it comes. Rodzianski slips. Robinson drives it. And this time he doesn't miss the layup. Robinson to the corner. Baines shots blocked. But a foul called. Two and a half seconds to go. it's ever been and he scored almost 2,000 points in high school he's got two now if he made dribbles are three at the most on a miss he's got all three trying to stay with Vic there's the home run ball Lucas with the catch taps it to Graham he's got a look yep just off the mark TCU upsets Kansas the 
uh, go out and uh, remember this kind of crowd that we're going to have tomorrow. So uh, a packed house and uh, certainly a great atmosphere for them to go out in. J.B. Dixon, look at that. He's got 26 wins here in the Garden as the coach in Pittsburgh before going back home to his alma mater, TCU at Fort Worth. NIT TCU taking on Georgia Tech. Horn Frogs, this is their first ever postseason championship game. Never done it in school history. And Kenridge Williams driving with the flush. TCU up by 13 at the half. The the Frogs with a 403 bang the ram with a leg up going. It's like this with an early timeout. Be at it again. The miss. And the put back. Flying out of nowhere is Kenrich Williams. He had a career high 25 points. Williams. One by one. Oh, that's when your career comes to an end. Yep. Says it all right there. Brandon Parrish. Day when we lost in Iowa State, we beat Kansas, we really up in Iowa, we beat Georgia Tech by 30. I mean, you know, I mean, we talk about this team, but well, how good are we? I mean, you, you, you wonder. Um, so we got a lot of them coming back.